craft beer nerds, welcome to another vlog. I hope you enjoyed last vlog. That was pretty fun. A little rusty on the vlogs, but hey, um, yeah, we'll get, it'll get better. It'll get better. But today, um, we are going to go to Cedar Creek Brewing in Martinsville, Indiana. They're having a pre prohibition party so basically you dress up in the 1930s or 1920s and it's a big party and everybody has a good time and we drink and then after that we're gonna go to Gillespie's cigar bar in Martinsville Indiana as well and that's a good time there even though I don't smoke cigars I still like to go there because they have excellent craft beer because that's what this vlog is all about it's all about craft beer and having a good time yeah Kelsey where's Kelsey she already left me. She went to Cedar Creek to get it all worked out. She works there. So, um, yeah. But I'm trying to figure out what to wear there. I really don't know what to wear. I could wear the same getup as I wore last year, which I had suspenders, just a bow tie and a white, um, a white dress shirt. But um, I have a, I have a peacoat. I don't know if I'm going to wear that or not. I don't know. As you can see, I got all kinds of dumb crap uh, that I have no idea what I'm wear wearing. I don't, I don't even know if these, like, should I wear brown boots? I have a gray vest. I have a white shirt. I don't even know if I'm gonna wear this pea coat. Uh, got some blue pants here. I don't even know if I'm gonna wear this vest or not. All right, this is it. This is my get up here. Uh. I picked this, picked this hat out. This is the black rose uh, hat that I'm wearing. Kind of matches the tie a little bit. Um, yeah, so there you have it. This party's gonna be awesome, man. We're gonna be drinking some good craft beer. We're gonna be out with uh, some good friends. Are you ready to, uh, you got a gun in there? You got a Tommy gun in there? Listen, yeah. The yeah. check goes down yeah. right now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, shit. <laughs> Damn, we're getting crazy in our kitchen. We finally made it to uh, Cedar Creek, having a good time, drinking a revival, which is the Speakeasy's uh, podcast beer that they made out here in Cedar Creek. It's a pre prohibition beer, um, and it's awesome. You should come out here and try it. Revival. So these, these guys are excellent uh, bartenders today. I'm from the future. I have a camera and I um, I came back in the past of 1930 just to film you guys. <laughs> so how are you guys liking it so far? It's a great turnout. So far so good. You guys been busy? Yes. Of course. Yeah, yeah, man. What's your favorite beer on tap right now? Oh, Revival. Man. Revival? Oh, good answer. That Cat 7 is really good. Good answer because um, Pete from the Speak Podcast is probably watching this and he's going to say, yep, Revival, that's right. <laughs> oh, man. Okay, here. I'm going to... Pete, everybody likes that Revival, man. How you liking Gillespie so far? Cheers! Cheers to that! We got Greg in here. Man, we are at Gillespie's. Hey, listen. This is a great cigar bar. Even though I don't drink cigars, I love the craft beer here. Oh, no. <laughs> yeah. Cut me off right now. Even though I don't smoke cigars, I love this place. This place has a great... This place is the best. It does. It has good craft beer here. So it's right in the square of Martinsville. It's got a red door. Just come on in and come on upstairs. If the light's on, they're open. Oh, you have it. the best bartender I'm, ever. I'm there you go. Absolutely. Yeah. No, don't go you don't know yeah. what to drink. No. He'll ask you a few questions and make you the best drink you've ever had. 
Oh, and you hear it, you heard it here first. I'm having the Founders Oktoberfest. I'm a sucker for Oktoberfest. I will get this every time they have it on their draft. But man, I'll tell you what, these guys know their beer. They have a great selection of craft beer. Even if you don't like cigars, I don't even smoke cigars, but I come here for the craft beer. Cheers. All right, Greg, what you drinking on? Well, as you can tell, I'm not in my garage, but this right here is a garage beer. It is very good, light, pleasing, refreshing. Cheers. Cheers. Cheers.